Hi, this video is to help you use your Megascan 3D asset with PBG. So, let's go with it. So, before using your machine PBG, you have to make some prerequisites. And these are pretty simple. You have to make your mesh look like the one which come with PBG. So, the first thing is the pivot, which is like you see in the bottom left corner of the mesh. So you must be sure that your mesh has his pivot right here. Otherwise, you have to modify it. And the second one is the rotation that must be this way. So you have to make the x-axis in front of you. This is the only way to make your mesh work. So I tried with uh, Megascan uh, 3D assets, which comes with a cool uh, 3D assets, uh, especially if you make buildings. But the first thing I noticed is when you grab your uh, 3D mesh from Megascan, which I already download, and you can see that it's okay with the pivot. It's in the bottom left corner, so no problem. Although maybe you have to make a change for this one. But it's okay, it's, it's great, no problem with the pivot. And the second one is the rotation. So, we're gonna, uh, after, uh, my, my old way is to use Blender to make the rotation. And, um, which is fortunate, is uh, with uh, Unreal Engine 5 comes a modeling tool, which is in a beta, which, but is okay, we can use it for our purpose. So, before going to the modeling tool, please make sure that you have the plugin already installed and uh, uh, you can use it. If not, just go to the plugins and make sure you have modeling, the modeling tools editor mode and the static mesh editor modeling mode already checked and ready to use. So mine are all are ready. So what I have, I gonna just make my toolbar right here. And you have to go to the option which comes. Just select, just select your uh, your 3D for Mega Scan. Then look for transform, and that, there it is. This is the transform. So I check transform. Then make a rotation of minus 90, and I think it's okay. Just make a complete. And you can see that now our mesh is compliant with PBG. The next step is you have to make the changes back to the asset. Because if you don't do so, uh, the next time you grab the asset from your... Go to back. You can see that the changes are not made. So to make sure that the changes are made to the asset, Go back to your asset, which you already changed. Go back to modeling mo mode, then go to transform and make the bake rotation and scale into mesh asset. This way, I accept. Got some warning, no problem. It's okay, I accept. And the next time I grab the asset, that's it. It's okay. So, final step, make sure you save your asset. This way, each time you make a grab on the editor, your mesh will be ready for PBG. So, that's it for this video. See you in the next one.